Gerald Lee Bledsoe on August 23, 1943, Jerry B, as he was affectionately known by millions of adoring fans, got his start in radio in his adopted hometown of Buffalo, New York, on radio station WUFO. It didn't take long, however, for Jerry's soothing, deep baritone voice to be recruited to join WWRL in New York City. WWRL, New York City. Jerry Bledsoe. RL-16 with the Planet Rock. Soul Sonic Force at 302 on WWRL. You and me on this Friday afternoon, sharing it together with a host of beautiful people to keep us company, musically speaking, until 6. Not to be outdone, the Sutton family, who owns WBLS, AM, and FM in New York City, convinced Bledsoe to join their ranks alongside such notables as Frankie Hollywood Crocker. WBLS 107.5 in a class by at 7.29 in New York on Jerry Bledsoe. The Temptations kick off more nonstop music when we return. Next stop for the man with the golden voice was that of being the morning man at 96.3 WHUR, right here in Washington, D.C. Mercy now. Hey, Wayne Prentice over in Fredericksburg, Virginia, really do appreciate your good vibes, brother. Hang tough, it's you and me in the morning on 96.3. Again being in high demand, Jerry soon moved to nights at Magic 102.3, which is part of the Radio 1 network also in D.C. The best variety of hits and oldies. Ron Thompson after midnight with more good listening for you. Within each one of us is a guiding light, an instinct for survival, a yearning for a better life, a longing for happiness, an ability to change and cope discover and grow the possibilities are all there lighting up our lives each time we take time to believe in ourselves have a good night yet an even better tomorrow bledsoe's final port of call was detroit michigan where he consistently beat the competition in the seven to midnight time slot at WMXD KISS FM. Night Mix 92.3. Not only do you hear it, you feel it. And you feel the love this evening. Don't it make you feel so necessary? Love, the feeling, the freshness, the exhilaration, the intoxicating happiness. It's like on a warm summer night. The window open. The air has just enough breeze to let you stand there as naked as the day you were born. Jerry was no stranger to television. He hosted a weekly dance program entitled Soul Alive up in the Big Apple. But one of the special moments of his TV career came during this national commercial for Budweiser, seen during the 1985 Super Bowl. This Bud's for everyone who's in the groove. It's five minutes on the upswing of five. Outside is 87 degrees under sunny blue skies. Flash. I'm moving out of here, having myself an ice cold brew. Yeah, just for you. That distinctively clean, crisp taste that says Budweiser. All you do is Budweiser for you. I know. <laughs> During his illustrious career, Jerry B was voted Disc Jockey of the Year by both Billboard and BRE magazine. Although he's no longer with us, Jerry's influence still remains as a result of the numerous broadcasters that he mentored across this country. That includes his very own son, Carlos Bledsoe, who is heard on Magic 102.3 right here in the capital city. Jerry Bledsoe, the newest member of the AAMI Radio Hall of Fame. Ready to sign the magazine? Go on and check it out. All right, y'all, let's get some party. 